Thanks for watching. The Terre Haute City Council addresses the tax abatement situations for select companies. During the meeting this evening, the council wanted to see if these companies held up their end of the bargain. Zach Sidham was at the meeting. And Zach, how did this meeting go? Well, these types of meetings usually go very smoothly, and this was no different tonight. City council meetings like this don't happen very often. They take place once a year to see if select companies are complying with the tax abatements they received. Curtis DeBond is the president of the Terre Haute City Council, and he explains in more detail what this meeting consists of. Every year we review our abatements to make sure that the companies who have received them are following through with what they told us they would do. Um, those that do not are called in for a special meeting to explain the situation. Tonight's meeting focused on two companies, Gavina and KJB Holdings. Both had representatives at the meeting, and DeBond said there were some issues with their abatements, but it proved not to be a problem. Both of the companies that had um, not been in compliance with us with their abatements were able to explain why they were not, and they both had valid reasons. So uh, ultimately, we approved to continue on with their abatements. The company that did not have a representative present was Tri Aerospace. This is because they went out of business. There was also a normally scheduled city hall meeting that followed that, followed that discussed a few recent zoning issues. Back to you. All right, thanks.